How did you hook up with Bieber? How did I hook up with Bieber? Uh, there's a guy named Michael George. He managed Martin Garrix at the time, and he worked at uh, Scooter Braun Projects. And they uh, were asking, Justin was going to get back into touring and get back to working, making music. And they're like, Do, does anybody know internally a videographer? And he was like, hey, Rory, you should check him out. He works with Martin. And they became really good friends. And, you know, maybe that could be something for Justin. So I met his team uh, 20, into 2014. And they loved me. And then it was about four months of trying to, like, have us meet up together to see if we vibed. Mm. I just happened to be at the right place at the right time at Ultra Music Festival where he came out with Skrillex. Such a great and I was on stage with my camera and I saw Allison, one of the ladies that interviewed me during that time, and she just kind of gave me a look and I was like, all right, I need to shoot this and shot it, went home, edited a little quick video, sent it to them, and she was like, yo, is this Rory's video? Can we use it? And from there, Sick. Justin was like, yo, this is our dude. Oh Sick. My God, yeah. dude. Very cool. I'm sure you have a bunch of crazy Bieber stories. I do, yeah. <laughs> can, you say, can you give us one? Uh, I mean, my favorite story is we were in New York on Labor Day weekend. I was just working with them. It's about six in the morning, and we're playing uh, NHL hockey on like PS4 or whatever. And I'm like, dude, I can't play again. I, I have to go catch a flight to go home to for mo or Labor Day weekend. I'm going to go see my family back at the lake. And he's like, all right, cool. Tell Corey to buy me a flight. I'm going to go pack right now. I'm going to come with you. And I was like, it's like, you're going to come, you're going to come to Indiana to like my parents' house. Like, okay. what? and this guy, this guy literally takes the closet hangers and all and just shoves it into the suitcase. And it's just like, when he unzipped it at my parents' house, it was just like hangers. Just like, shut up. Everywhere. Shut up. It was, it was crazy. He just came with you. Came yeah. With how do you why? explain that? How so, do you explain that? And here's the crazy part. So he, I end up like, they're like, we're going to switch you to a different flight. So they switched me to a different flight. So we're all on the same flight. I make it to the airport in time. And I was like, I'm not missing this. I get my own Uber. And Justin's like, where are you? And I'm like, I'm on the way to the airport. He's like, all right, I'm coming. Like, I'll meet you there. So I'm at the gate and I'm like, she's like last call. And I was like, well, I'm waiting on uh, a guy named Mikey, Justin's security guard and Justin Bieber. And she's like, Justin Bieber. <laughs> like, I was like, you have like the list, look. And she's like- She's like calling security. She's like- <laughs> There is a Justin Bieber on here, but she's like, it can't be Justin Bieber. And I'm like, yeah, just somebody else has the same name. Okay. <laughs> so I end up getting on the flight and he's like, hey, we end up taking the original flight that you're on. I'm like, great. So now I'm going to a different city, like close to my parents. And I call my mom and I was like, hey, like I wanted to surprise you guys. And I, I was going to be the surprise, like coming home this mm. weekend. Like, yes, I wasn't coming, but I'm coming. They're like, oh, I knew it. I knew it. I was like, but. Um, Justin Bieber and his security guard are going to arrive probably an hour before me. Oh my God. And mom's like, wait, what? And like, so then it was just, I was like, don't tell anybody, like, got to keep this under wraps. That's, so I show that's up. That's crazy. He's, he's taking a nap and, uh, all my friends come over. We go out on the boat and everybody was just like, they're like, they took their photos, but they're like, Hey, I'll wait till you leave. So you don't have like, yeah. everybody doesn't know. Yeah. Well, that night we end up going to that bar. I was showing you that chain. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we go to my friend's bar for a drink. And then Justin like goes up, like after the band was playing, he's like, Hey, can I play your drums? And the guy's like, sure. And all of a sudden <laughs> everybody's phones out and in this bar packed to like 350 people like that. And like line around the door. Oh my God. It was crazy. Okay. That's, so then, that is that's wild. Nuts. So then that's we had people nuts. like camping outside our house, like that is trying to so crazy. Yo, that kid's pool is insane. It's, it's, yeah. it's nuts.